Okay, so this is a reading of the Christopher Columbus Reader um, for Lesson 2.3. A Sailor from Italy Way back in 1451, in Genoa, Italy, a boy was born, and as he grew, he longed to sail the sea. His father was a weaver, as was his mother, too. But following his father's footsteps, he didn't want to do. So here's our little boy. He's from Italy, and his parents are weavers. He took his maiden voyage, maiden means first, at the young age of 14. From then on, it was a sailing ship on which the boy was seen. For many years the young man sailed, then one day his ship sank. He saved himself from certain death by holding to a plank. He came ashore in Portugal and made Lisbon his home. He married there and had a son, but twas the sea he wished to roam. To search for gold in the East Indies was where the sailor longed to go. He asked Portugal's king for assistance, but he politely told him no. His brother, named Bartholomew, also asked the king of France. He looked at him bewildered, then he said, not a chance. The sailor sought financial backing from the king and queen of Spain. At first they were not interested. His attempts appeared in vain. For many years the young man yearned to make this voyage to the east. He promised in exchange for ships he'd bring them back a feast. Queen Isabella and King Ferdinand were mildly interested. They agreed to sponsor him, but it was Italian money they invested. When they said yes, the man set sail. This voyage was his idea. His caravels were the Nina and the Pinta. His flagship was the Santa Maria. In 1492, he sailed for months out on open sea. His name was Christopher Columbus, and the rest was history. So you will have to answer these questions by either printing this off and then circling and scanning back to me, or you can just type them in your online text box for the lesson. If you call me, I'm happy to help you out with that. Good luck.